Okay, so I just made breakfast. I made papa con huevo, aka potato with eggs, potato and egg. I'm actually feeling so good right now because I went to sleep at 10.30 p.m. So now I'm feeling so energized and then with this coffee, I'm just feeling extra in the mood, so I'm happy. I think I need to do this more often. Like the whole getting like proper sleep. I just randomly decided yesterday that I wanted to do this kind of like week in the life thing because my life's gonna be randomly kind of interesting, kind of. So I was like, I might as well just take advantage and show you what it's like to be an NYU student. Yeah, actually every single night until Saturday from tonight to Saturday, I am filming in the theater because there's gonna be a dance concert that I'm not a part of, I'm not performing, but all my friends are, so I'm so excited to film them. And today's a dress rehearsal and then the rest of the nights are actual concert. And then today I'm filming my fall lookbook video. After I eat breakfast, I'm just gonna start creating outfits and putting them in a specific order, hopefully. Then I also have some online classes that are honestly just, the one I have today, she screams so much. Okay, Canadian Thanksgiving is on Monday, but we're celebrating on Sunday night. And then Monday is... It's not Columbus Day. It is Indigenous People's Day. Scratch that out of my, of my calendar. But anyway, we get a day off from school because... We live in the US and that's just how it is. Also, a part of my routine, whenever I'm gonna film in the mornings, and since I'm doing my fall lookbook video today, I love putting on these Detoxify Pixie eye patches. I usually put them on when I'm making breakfast if I'm gonna film that day. I always wake up with my face poofy, as you can see right now. Poofy. Some people say puffy, but I forever am gonna say poofy. Okay, never mind. I just got an email that we do have class on Monday. So I think NYU is not celebrating Columbus Day, thank God. But I just don't have technique class because there's a show this weekend and so they give us a day off to rest even though I'm not performing, but I guess I would like to rest from filming. I forgot to mention, I'm not trying to roast the glass or anything, but it's called Latino pop culture. It's interesting, but if you don't feel like getting screamed at every Monday and Wednesday, don't take it. Okay, so for example, now only, okay, well, we're all here. Let me get the gallery view. To write these papers. Ask me about groups you're thinking about, or you know, you can do it on your own, absolutely. I came back to take a shower and to change into my super cute outfit because I'm going to the theater to see dress rehearsal for this week's dance concert. And I'm so excited because it's gonna be a part of my work study. So I'm gonna be getting paid. And I have been waiting so long to have a work study and to be a part of the work study in the dance building. I've been through a whole process where I was like approved after applying and everything and then just never getting scheduled or the pandemic happening but I'm finally gonna be recording the concerts and getting paid I am volunteering two nights and I've already volunteered last year a lot of nights recording the concerts so it's nothing different so I'm kind of just looking at it as like a little tip to like stop myself from crying because you it, it went from like a piano song to silence and you just hear me like because <laughs> everybody did so good so much today because I was kind of in a rush I filmed as much as I could for the lookbook video and then I went to dance and now I'm just gonna sort the footage that I shot earlier and then I'm gonna go and film the first show of the week
scared. I like, I double tape. How do you look so graceful? Oh, the Wi Fi. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. Happy Friday. I am exhausted. I literally, I am exhausted. I kid you not. I just looked in the mirror and went like this. Like. So it turns out that I'm not recording the rest of the shows because it's not in the work study budget and I was gonna volunteer, but it's this whole thing because of COVID. Like they already have a body count for the people in the audience. There's only like 18 people allowed in the theater and they didn't account for me and Owen to be recording. So we're gonna take turns and just go into the theater and put an SD card into the wide shot camera that's like hung on the ceiling and just press record and then leave and then come back at the end of the show and press stop. Just because we want our friends to have have that footage for their reels and for whatever they need it for. Yeah, and it's nice to have the footage from every night because opening night is usually like shaky. Although I thought they did pretty good yesterday. But yes, I also didn't know that my camera angle was being live streamed. They like definitely bumped up the tech in the theater. And now there's like a whole setup in the middle where the tech person is like clicking which camera angle is gonna be shown on zoom depending on like what's going on on stage super cool so he was like choosing between three camera angles and i was one of them i'm so glad it's friday i never do homework on fridays i like do not allow myself to do homework on fridays i'm acting like if i did homework all week i i don't think i've done any homework this week but still i don't allow myself to think about school on fridays and then i have to do an essay on the weekend because it's due on monday improved yes. <laughs> Today's homework day, unfortunately. So I'm going to Brooklyn to my boyfriend's apartment so that we can actually make sure that we're both doing our work because I've been sitting on my desk procrastinating and watching fashion YouTube videos and that needs to stop. So, and then later today, I'm going to film the last show for SADC and then baking a pumpkin pie for Canadian Thanksgiving with Asia. We came. <laughs> this is what you do when you have a bunch of homework. You ignore it. And you get pizza. And then you order pizza. What is this? I don't get it. I think they miss like cheese, I guess. Thank you. 
Bushes. <laughs> There's a lady in a coat waiting for us in the bushes. It's technically <laughs> illegal. No, we're going to Kimmel Center and then we're not allowed to eat before, so we're gonna get Dunkin' after. And we might walk around Washington Square even though it's drizzling. Thank you for watching and subscribe.